All right, everybody, we have to talk about auto implemented properties. This is an intimidating name, but don't worry, it's actually fairly simple. They are shortcuts when no additional logic is required within a property. You do not have to define a field for a property and you only have to write get and or set inside the property. Here's an example. I have a class car. And what if we would like a model field and property? So that might look something like this. Make sure to not make your field public for this example. So this will be a string named model for a model of car. And I would like to set up a property that has get and set accessors. So that would be public string model with a capital M curly braces. And then I need a get and a set accessor. All we'll do within the get accessor is return model. And that's the field. And a set will be model our field equals value. And within my constructor, I will set this dot model property, make sure that you have capital M equals model, whatever our parameter is. So if you're not doing anything else within your getter and setter, there's actually a shortcut to all of this, and that's by using an auto implement property. So this is what we'll do. We're going to instead get rid of all this and type public string model with a capital M curly braces, get semicolon set semicolon. And this will do the same thing. However, it's a lot less to write so if there's no additional logic that you need besides, you know, setting the value and getting the current field, well, you can just use an auto implemented property and this will do the same thing. Let's test it. So let's create a car object, car, car equals new car, then pass in a model of car. Let's say a Porsche this time. And then I would like to display the car's model, car dot model property with a capital M. So there will still be a model field, but it's hidden. And this car's model is a Porsche. So that's like a shortcut you can do. An auto implemented property is a shortcut when no additional logic is required in the property. You do not have to define a field for a property and you only have to write get and or set inside the property. So yeah, that is an auto implemented property. If you liked this video, please give it a thumbs up, drop a random comment down below and subscribe if you'd like to become a fellow bro.